wanna rock right now. I'm 19, I came to get down. What's going on, everybody? We're in the kitchen in Barcada, Hollywood right now. I got my man, Chef Josh, here. We got a special menu catered for this TV dinner episode. My man, Josh, is gonna walk us through exactly what we got going on. Thanks for having me. Thank so you, bro. Right here, we have one of our famous in-house dishes, one of our favorites, it's um, dynamite and shrimp. Uh, all it is is just seared shrimp, a little bit of garlic. We'll top it off with our nice hot sauce. Nice little black slate. Oh, buddy. <laughs> Look at that shrimp. A little bit of garnish. The sauce is just melting. Start off with our next dish, one of our other favorites, our garlic noodles. Garlic noodles. <laughs> Secret recipe, by the way. <laughs> you guys aren't going to get the scoop of what's in that pan right now. That butter for that thickness, maybe. Yep, yeah, it gives a nice creamy texture. Let that simmer for a little bit. All right, guys, we got the full spread right here. We got the garlic noodle, we got the calamansi wings, we got the tokwa, we got the lumpia, and we got the dynamite shrimp. I'm about to dig in. Let's see what's good. Oh, yo, that aioli. Perfectly melted. Got such a zing to it. Let's hit this tokwa really quick. I'm not a big tofu guy. Perfectly crispy. This sauce is out of this world. Let's hit this lumpia right here. This is Lola's lumpia, so you know it's real. Lola knew what she was doing when she came up with this recipe, let me tell you. She knew exactly what she was doing. Are you gonna try the noodles? Oh, uh, the noodles, I'm saving the best for last. We're going for these calamansi wings. I love wings, so we got a high standard to live up to here. Oh, oh buddy. It's got such a different flavor to it. It's not what you expect from a wing. It's got, it's got like a, a zest to it. Oh. And last but not least, we got the garlic noodle. This, gar this is the best garlic noodle in LA, don't at me. Like I said, the best garlic noodle in LA, don't at me. This is episode 26 of TV Dinner. Doing this. 26 episodes, once a month. So thank you guys again for coming out. I would like to give a warm welcome to our guest for the evening, Jay Raybon. Yo. Yeah. Thanks for on, having man? me, bro. Thank you for coming on. Appreciate, Appreciate it. it. Appreciate it. Um, so for a lot of our guests here and the people at home who are going to be watching, let them know a little bit about yourself. Hi, guys. I'm Jonathan Raybon, also known as Jay Raybon. I'm a dancer first, and uh, I've been doing music for about 10 years now, but uh, 2015 is when I started taking it serious. I dance for pretty much every artist you can think of within this past decade uh, from the highest level possible. I used to think very local when it came to music, but uh, I think when you're standing on a stage in front of 80,000 people with Justin Bieber, it's like it kind of does something to your mental. So I really like dove into this music thing real serious uh, these past few years. and. 
I saw my, the potential within myself. So, uh, yeah. No, oh, what a subtle flex. He's like, yeah, you know, highest level artist. You get in front of 80,000 people. You know, it kind of changes your perspective. It does. I promise it does. So you moved out here for dance originally? Yes. From At, the Bay? Yes. Uh, well, the bay. Uh, so yeah, so I got family out in the Bay. I was born in the Bay. I was born in Oakland, California. Yeah. Can I get a yee right quick? Yeah. Come on, man. Let's go. When I was in sixth grade, my family, we up jumped and moved to Arizona. And then for like a year, and then my mom missed family. So we came back and we landed in Sacramento. So from like middle school up until I graduated, I was I was in Sacramento. My mom kind of saw something in me like my freshman year of high school. And uh, she started putting me in classes and all that stuff. Uh, I started take, going to conventions. Uh, I'm not sure if you're familiar with like dance conventions, but like Monsters of Hip Hop. Anybody know? Yeah. Tay educates me, you know, okay. she puts me on. I'm kind of hip, you know, I don't really know how to dance, but right I on, right on. Uh, but yeah, Monsters I've been to of- Carnival, you know, I know what's going on. <laughs> man, shout out to Carnival, man. They've been going strong for some years now. But uh, <laughs> but yeah, Monsters of Hip Hop is uh, what what really got me into it. Um, they do a showcase every, every summer from... And they picked like 14 kids uh, to come out to LA and work with, you know, top choreographers. And uh, I did it back in 2007. That's when I got like scouted by my agency. And uh, they were like, yeah, we'll sign you when you move out here. And I was like, oh, okay. Just 19 and like very like, oh, okay, I'm gonna do this. So uh, it was, it, I would say like they that gave me the push to move out here. Um, I was, you know, I moved out here with my cousin. I lived in her living room. <laughs> I was fortunate enough to start working like back to back and uh, started, I did my first tour then. And then uh, I did my first major tour within that first year, uh, Britney Spears circus tour. Damn, first year. Yeah, Look at this guy. it was crazy. Son of but, flex um, again. <laughs> <laughs> From there, it's just like the snowball effect. It just like jobs just kept coming. Again, very fortunate because, you know, you can ask any dancer that moves out here. It, it's either hit or miss you know what i'm saying and the times have changed with like instagram and social media because you know uh dancers are popping they for themselves now they don't have to like go and work for artists like you can do your own thing so back then it was it was like it was only artists you know what i'm saying you looked at that like oh i want to do this this is where i guess the money is whatever but yeah all right uh i guess i'm gonna perform uh, some songs uh <laughs> So this lovely guy right here, his name's Miko. He's on the ones and twos, yeah? Uh, yeah, so this song that I'm about to do, put out a song and um, I was like, ah, oh, I see my potential. <laughs> so uh, I hit up Miko and I was like, yo, I, I, I wanna perform this song, but I think I wanna do it acoustic and just, I don't know, figure it out and just do it different vibes. So we got together, probably had like, what? Really just like one rehearsal, and then we kind of had like the voice notes, and I was like. Yeah, so uh, wish me luck. Um, but yeah, we're going to do that. All right. Let's go. And I'm in your city doing numbers More top, send back, count money But no bitch from the alley, she be shining When I pull up in my weed, they be young, yeah Getting guar like my last name, Franklin Big bankroll, busting out my pocket All I know, all I know is how to get it My shit authentic, I ain't for the fabrication, no Whoa, I go, I go to Bad bitch, I'm a dick, tryna make a porno You live it this deep, but you know it's not the journal, yeah Papa John, Papa John, where she coming? Hey, whoa, I go, I go to Twisting Tropicana in a villa with a model She a center for I make a post for me Artist fly shit down me, I should be a pilot Hey, whoa, I go, I go to Run it through a chair, make it bad by tomorrow Yeah, whoa, I go, I go to Yeah, I uh, baby, turn around, let me see what they're here for Roll it in a circle if you're trying to get these pesos Dame lo que quiero, trying to get what I pay for Ay, I'm trying to get what I pay for Champagne to the face, we party on a Sunday Yeah, do it all again on Mondays Cardi for the friends, got me feeling like I'm good there, throw to the pussy, yeah, I kill it like I'm Tupac 
Huh, yo bitch, she a rider gristed like she switching gears in a rurry. Hot tank, now they won't be bobbing at the highway from a place where I go. Then my niggas still happy. White tee, blue jeans, cut the check like Nike. All the way, yeah, see the birds flying by me. Pop a molly like a willy, whoa, whoa, wanna Harley, yeah, yeah. A nigga just getting started, hey, whoa. I go, I go to Twist and Tropicana in a villa with a motto She a cinephobe, I make a pose for me Hardest fly shit, don't be, I should be a pilot Hey, whoa, I go, I go to Yeah, I go, I go to Hey, whoa, I go, I go to Say that, whoa, I go, I go to Whoa, what, I Yeah, I Hey, whoa, I Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, You took it serious in 2015, but you've been doing it longer, right? Yeah, yeah. When did it start for you musically? Like, when did you start taking an interest in making music? Uh, do you remember um, making a band? Of course. <laughs> okay. I did. He's bringing it back, by the way. <laughs> it's not going to be the same, though. I promise. No, definitely not. <laughs> but um, I would see them, like, write music, and I just remember being just, like, super young. Like, oh, how do you, like, how do they do that? So I remember picking up, you know, getting a, a paper and getting a pencil and just kind of, like, trying to make sense of words and make them rhyme. And that was, like, the first time. I, this was probably, like, uh, I was probably, like, 13, 14 at the time. Um, and then 2009, I revisited it, um, started writing again. Um, my best friend, Jay Blaze, uh, we did a, um, we kind of like, we were a duo, uh, kind of around the jerkin nope. era. Oh, we yeah, like, oh yeah, 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 we could do this. And um, at the time, like, it kind of just like, we both went our own ways just because uh, our dance careers like took off. So it just kind of like, yeah. yeah natural, yeah, yeah, for sure. So you said in 2015, you started taking it serious. What was that moment that made you decide like, all right, I'm trying to explore this other realm of creativity for myself? I just, I, I think I, I tapped in with the right people. Um, shouts out to my mentor, uh, who's been rocking with me since 2013. And he just kind of brought me around the right people. And um, shouts out to my, my engineer slash producer, Exact, who's just like been there, like championing me for for so long and helping me find my voice and you know the sounds I, w I really want to tap into again I'm from the Bay Area so like I, I, I grew up in the peak of the hyphy movement you know yeah. what I'm saying so I know what that is I know what it's like to go to functions and just go stupid and go dumb you know what I'm saying for the people that don't know like that was a special moment in time for like like people in Northern California you feel me that's what like really r really did it for me so when I really started to be like okay I, I can tap into this sound or I can try to do you know go into the whole lyrical sound and storytelling um it just started to like make sense for me in 2015 again i that's when i put out like two records and one of those records really you know did something that showed me and again i'm, I'm funding yeah. everything yeah, yeah yeah so like no no marketing no nothing it just kind of like did its own thing you know what i'm saying it made, like when i uh put it up on spotify and all that good stuff uh it like hopped on like fresh finds playlists and all that and that's a you know spotify yeah, editorial good. playlist and it's like it's hard to get on those so to like not have any backing or just have people in the game who's in that world like i thought that that was big and i just started seeing my potential within it yeah yeah, yeah uh this next song is uh called uh tequila tales um it's featuring talented artist right there his name's jordan ward um <laughs> we actually put out a visual not too long ago for this one. Um, if you haven't, if you haven't seen it, please go check it out. It's a it's an art piece, and I say that very humbly. Um, yeah, but we're gonna try this acoustically. Tells. I drank from the well, now I'm under her spell. Damn, the way that she feels. I lust for the thrill, I rage in the field. Free is a bird that cannot be concealed. Move with the wind, I swerve in the automobile. I get in my feels, these females belong to the game. This is a fucked up ordeal, I'm forgiving. Did I mention I've been sipping, 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 sipping? Whoa, lifted. 
This is what you call surfing a wave in the Pacific. Fear of the light is making me anxious. Out in the boo, mixing tequila with booze. No time to snooze. I sell and I cruise. I like them in twos. We menage in the pool, breaking the rules. She is my muse. I'm lit like a witch. Shot at the shot, you would think I grow sick. I look in the mirror, no recollection of who I become. Where I once stood, far right the sight. Bitches pulling me, left and the right. She giving me head, back at the club. Her ass is so fat, made her bounce it back. Niggas be like, hey, where you at? Back at the lack, my no bitch sit on my lap. No time to recap, I'm enticed by the way she appears. Uber maneuver, it's way through the hills. Lou, but time for her heels. Blood on the street, drink to suppress all my fears. Having these niggas is weird. They talk to me like we is kin. Fuck out my face. Need me some space. Never require a chase. See my mistakes. I'm scared of this place. These demons is showing they face. Hold up. What? Right on, right on. Miko, everybody. This is Miko. How long did it take you until you actually started really fucking with your music? You know, because like you start, you're first making music, and for a while you're just like, man, all this shit is trash. You know, you just hate everything. Yeah. How long did it take until you really felt like, yo, I feel really comfortable with what I'm putting out? I would say, I would say uh, top of this year when I dropped my uh, my debut project. Yeah. Yeah. That's when I was like, yeah, all right, I, yeah. I do this. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I, feel like I, <laughs> I you do. You could this, comfortably yeah. say it, you know, straight up. That's like that's the side that they never really tell you, right? Is that because you're listening to your favorite artists and you don't see how much shit that they went through to get to the point where you're listening to a product that you enjoy yeah. that they're also comfortable with, you know? Especially yeah. as an artist, like you're, we're so hard on ourselves out of anyone. Cre- creatives in general. Yeah, creatives in general. Yeah. yeah. So it's wild. I mean, even just hearing you, you're like, yeah, I took it serious in 2015. I got something on Fresh Vines, but I didn't start really really enjoying what I make until 2019 is four years later you yeah know? yeah so it's really showing you like the and still so like uh, you make. shout out to my best friend Michael right there <laughs> <laughs> um but like he, he you know he says something where it's like you know uh everything that I'm making right now it's like it's not your best music yet you know um it's just it's again it's just progress and it's it's levels to this and you know in two years I'll go back to you know this first project and I'll be like damn i've grown so much i won't be like that shit's whack because yeah you yeah. know at that time when i dropped it i'm like i felt confident and and that's what it was for me you know but um yeah it's you're we're always like progressing and all that stuff and another thing like yo creators we're, we're so hard on ourselves uh I, I i just posted something uh shouts out to nipsey hustle uh and you know what i'm saying he, he posted uh something where it's just like where he says like, "Yo, I went through every emotion with this shit, every." And I and I used to hear that. Like, I remember watching that, and and I never fully understood it. But I'm in a time in my life right now where like I fully understand what he's saying because I'm going through shit right now where I'm like, "Yo, <laughs> like, am I really trying yeah, to do this?" Because this real. shit is just like, it's just it taxing draining. on the mental, yeah, bro. Yeah, like, definitely. it's crazy. Yeah, definitely. Let's go. Turn me up, though. Yeah. Shout out to my brother YMTK, Miles Parrish. Whoa, turn me up, turn me up, ooh. Uh, more to track, more to track. Yeah, yeah. Hey, hey. She said, Ray, why don't you do me like the mother hoes? Yeah, she was smiling when she said it, though. All my niggas got dreads on the dance floor. Exact on production, finna let it go. Yeah, I smile when I get bitches on the kid. I hit it like a lid. Too legit to quit. Happy babies in this bitch. Ay, word to the hammer in the land of the fish. You can tell how I dance. I ain't from around here. Sweating off a pill with the gold in my grill. Drinking out the bottle. I be feeling myself. It's the motto that I follow. I don't know nothing else. Make that ass shake, shake like an earthquake. She been in the stank gigging. It's her birthday. Little baby got rid of She in first place. Me and Murph really with it. South Sack, yeah, you know I keep it going. Land of the pin talk, mouth full of goings. Rolling down, flowing, and I'm mobbing like a stolen in the section with the tie smoking, side showing, yeah, yeah. 
and she say she from the A. Let her way I talk, cause she know I'm from the Bay. Going still be on that ass from the back with no brakes. Shack it up and down like she came from out of. If it ain't about chicken, my nigga stay up on my face. If your bitch get one look at my nigga, she gon' get a taste. Got the game from the water, my nigga, something about the way. Got the glee from the top of my nigga. I'm a heartbreak nigga with a pretty ass face If I tell her when to go, she gon' run it like a play And I'm crowded in the whip, so you know that thing's great But the window stripping with a smile on my She let her way I smile when I'm gigging I'm on a wave with little baby with the ribs Whoa, whoa, watch, watch me, me, smile watch me, gigging. watch me Got little baby smiling when she gigging Yeah, I know she fucking with it Yeah, Cause little baby smiling when she gigging yeah. I know she fucking with it Little baby smiling when she gigging whoa. I do. I know she fucking with it. Right, I think I think I got a schmeeze right quick. Hold on. Here we go. baby smiling while she gigging. I know she fucking with it. I know she fucking with it. I know she fucking with it. Do baby smiling while she gigging. She got a way smile when I'm gigging. Yeah. I'm on a wave with little baby with the ribs. Yeah. Watch me smile while I'm gigging. Got little baby smiling while she gigging. I know she fucking with it. Yes, sir. Shout out to my brother YMTK. And again, Miles Parrish is on that record as well. If you go look it up. So it seems that you've had some good guidance in this journey so far. Yeah, yeah. What would you say is the best piece of advice that you've gotten as a creative overall? You know, it doesn't have to be just for music, but just as like a creative out here in LA. Um, if you really want to do whatever it is you do and whatever field you're in, if you really want to do it, creatives in general, like be prepared to go through all those fucking struggles excuse my french you know what i'm saying like dancers come out here and they're just like oh we, i want this shit to happen and, and i want to dance for this and and on these this artist and be this and it's like but are you prepared to struggle because it's not just gonna happen like are you prepared you know what i'm saying so i think if uh i think that's the best advice like it's like yo just thug through it you know what i'm saying lean into to all the heartache that comes with it you know because those highs will even be higher when you break through that moment you know yeah and that's real folks that's some real shit right there yeah so after our two year i came up with a with a new final question for the interview and i think this one's really dope it's gonna stump you i hope so at least if you haven't prepared i'd be uh, i'd be pretty shocked if you <laughs> had to make a project with one producer who would that producer be? Like any producer, dead or alive. Dang. Full length project. Full length project. I'm gonna just keep it 100, just because uh, I'm gonna have to say Pilo. Oh, damn. Yeah. Keeping yeah. it straight to the roots. Come on, man. Like, and he can hop on the tracks too. Huh? He, he can hop on the tracks too. You got the double yeah, whammy there. Yeah, that'd be hard. Yeah. Like, yeah, his production is just beautiful. Like, you know what I'm saying? Again, it's like the essence of what that time was with the modern touch. You know? For sure, yeah. for sure. That's some true Bay Area shit right there. <laughs> well, my man, shout out. Thank you for coming on the show. Appreciate you. Thank you guys for coming out. We got a dope performance lined up for you guys right now. Sit tight. My man's about to throw it down. Enjoy the food. Right on. Yeah. This next song, it's my last song. Uh, yeah. So uh, it's called uh, It's A Go. It's actually not out yet. It actually drops on Tuesday. Uh, yeah, we can get into it. Sheesh. Yeah. Yeah. Uh. Got family in a rich, I could have been a P. If she pop out with that K, come and get between. Yeah, baby girl shake it like a tambourine. Said she tired of broke boys, I'm her vaccine. She let her fuck with me, cause I get her wetter. I be hugging on her booty like a tight sweater. Ay, run up things down like a minute sprinter. Ay, get it from the bed like a fender binner. Yeah, bust that ass, baby, keep it going, uh. Swing, swing to the motion like you're swerving, yeah. Ay, there you go, there you go, uh. Hands on your knees, make your booty come, come. Bitches in the section with me, yeah No promoter, but I got them for the free, yeah 30D when I pull up to the scene, uh Big bad busting on my Fendi Ay, it's a, it's a, it's a go, go 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 It's a, it's
it's a, it's a guff, you turn the track up Hey, hey, uh Been all around the world getting pesos And I make these hoes pay me, I'm a gigolo Got a thick white bitch, she from Chico Hey, she dancing on my dick like a go-go With an ass like that, she know I'm watching Put that pussy on the plate, girl, I'm sorry I'm a killer, yellow tape, caution Bitch, keep them heels on the arch Pippa Pilo, put me on some, ayy Up all night, yeah, like I'm Koi John, yeah Blue hunnids make her ass go dumb, yeah Bitch, I look good, run me down funds, yeah Bad bitches in the section with me, yeah No promoter, but they got them for the free, ayy 30 deep when I pull up to the scene, uh Big bad bustin' on my Fendi, whoa It's a, it's a, it's a go, go It's a, it's a, it's a go, go It's a, it's a, it's a go, go It's a, ayy, ayy, uh in this thing with my rally and I stay gigging. Yeah, any in the inner system got it really with it. Yeah, bitch, go crazy, go crazy with it. Bitch, shake that, don't be lazy with it. Drop it, drop it to the clap, ayy. Wobble, wobble, bring it back, uh. Drop it, drop it to the clap, yeah. Wobble, wobble, bring it back, ayy. Bad bitches in the section with me, yeah. No promoter, but I got them for the free, ayy. 30 D when I pull up to the scene, uh. Big bad busting on my Fendi, wait. It's a, it's a, it's a go, go. It's a, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Raymond. Hey, let's make some noise for Jay Raymond one more time. That was dope, bro. Thank you guys again for coming out. I appreciate y'all. Um, yeah, this means the world to us. So dope to see so many friends and family in here um, just supporting. So um, nice not over. We're here till 10. We're going to be playing some music. Y'all keep ordering food if you want. Keep ordering drinks. But thank you guys. Love you guys.